also, uh, Jim and I, and I met Jim over uh, summer, and he went to a lot of Chicago act activist network meetings, which was kind of a newer um, organization that was kind of put together so that they could report, like all the chapters could report to uh, the regional office downtown to let them know what's going on and support that. And um, as a member, uh, I just wanted to uh, announce that the CAN actually just received an award for uh, Local Group of the Year. Um, and Jim was probably a very big part of that. Um, and Katie Sewell, and she was the one that came last year, if any of you guys were at the last year event, that's Katie. Um, they were a big part of that. So it's a congratulations to him too. Um, but without further ado again, let me introduce uh, Jim McDonald. And thank you for coming out. We have, as you can probably tell from the screens, a YouTube video that I think to start it will show that the AI produced. This is on a particular case in Sri Lanka, a case of Pradeep Namagoda, who is a uh, journalist who disappeared after leaving work January 24th, 2010, two days after he had published a comparison between the then incumbent presidential candidate President Indira Rajapaksa. The presidential election uh, in Sri Lanka was January 26th in County Texas. So this is two days before the election. And Pradeep publishes an article that compares the president with the opposition candidate uh, and coming out in favor of the opposition candidate. So two days after that article, uh, he is leaving work and he's never seen him. Uh, this is occurring in the context in Sri Lanka, tens of thousands of enforced disappearances, where we know that the Sri Lankan government or their agents have been responsible for picking people up and making them effectively disappear. The government saying, we don't know what's happened to them. We don't have them. We're so sorry. We don't know anything about them. Uh, Rajiv is just one more in connection with enforced disappearances. six-and-a-half-minute video that's mostly an interview with his wife, Savio. Sound quality, when Savio is talking, may not be the best because they had to film it in secret in her house back in Sri Lanka. But she's speaking in single anyway, so it's all subtitled. Well, except when your mom is talking. Most people hear them sing well.